everyone. Um, so today I'm here with the Shopkins Little Secrets. So I've got some of the little lockets here today. Um, so these are basically very similar to the old style vintage Polly Pockets, which I also collect and adore. Um, and where you get a little locket and then you also get a little figure. And with the Shopkins ones uh, that I've got today, you also get a little character. So I've got a mixture of series one, which is like this one. And then I've got series two, which is the party pop-up series. Um, so I've got eight all together. Um, and basically the reason why I'm doing this video is because I'm hoping to see if I get any different little characters. So if we just look at the checklist for the first one, it shows you all the different ones you can get. But for each uh, little mini playset or each locket, there's also usually like two or three different characters you can get. So you always get the same like mini shoppy doll but there's different actual little Shopkins that you can get. And as you can see, I've ticked off the ones that I've already got. So I'm hoping today to actually get some different ones. So uh, let's run through this checklist. So I'll just scan through this quickly so you can see if interested. There's a couple more on the back. So I haven't got all of these different play sets with me today. I do own them all, but these are just some extra ones I got to see if I can get some different characters. If you're interested in more Shopkins and Shoppy stuff, I will do another video and actually multiple videos showing like all the little play sets I have and all the dolls, like a proper video of the dolls behind me and stuff. Uh, I keep talking about this doll video. It will be coming. <laughs> it's just getting around to doing it and like because I have this other stuff I'm like trying to decide what to like unbox first or what to show first but this is what we're focusing on today anyway so I've got two of the first series and then I've got the other six of the second series and some of these like for example I've got three of these ones so all the play sets inside will be the same but I just want to see if we get some different um like little mini shopkins today so Let's start over here with this one. So this one is called, let's uh, check the checklist, Little Gems Jewelry. So it's a little jewelry shop and the character we have is Tiana Sparkles. And there's three different options. So Erin Earring, Radiant Ring Roo and Cara Crystal Pendant. So I actually have two of those. I'm really hoping to get the third one. So let's see what we get today. So let's open this up. So they come in like little cases. And you can just snip it either side and then it just sort of pulls off the top. Like so in here will be um, a little cord, so a little chain. Um, and basically, I don't know if I can open this. I won't bother to open it, but basically it's just like a little pink uh, chain that you can like attach to the locket. So if you wanted to wear it and also a checklist, but obviously we've already got checklists, which I had for my previous ones. So let's have a little look. So here's our tiny little compact. So it's so cute. It almost reminds me of like Princess Peach, this one. Do you know what I mean? Like the way her dress looks. So it is very princess themed. And then um, our character, I'll open that up in a second. Let's look at our little character. So yeah, so this is um, Tiara Sparkles. So there is a large shoppy doll of her. She's so cute. She's got a little crown, a little pink dress. Really adorable. So let's open up here. So we get a little blind bag. We'll look at that in a sec. But inside, so you can see that we've got a little mirror at the top. And then on the bottom, it's all like sort of jewelry and stuff like that. The little box here that actually lifts up. So like little interactive bits. And then also this little gem here, which can move. So she's actually got like, like the old Polly Pockets as well this little round base and basically you can like plug her in and then she's in here now and then she can sort of like be moved around which is pretty cute. So obviously they're very small, I just like to display them. I find for kids I don't know how much you can play with these because even though there's a couple of features they are very small but I suppose it's you know imagination if you had a couple of dolls and that you can make up scenarios and whatnot but yeah I just think they're really cute. So there's that one. So let's see what little mini shoppy we get with it. Okay, so it's this tiny little red one. So this is Erin Earrings. Sadly, this isn't the third one that I wanted, so I'm still going to be on the hunt for Cara Crystal Pendant. But this is a little Erin Earring we've got here, which is so cute. Like I said, I'll do a separate video, you know, showing the ones I do have and all the different sets. 
So there's the first one. And then with this little one, you can just sort of sit it anywhere. So I'd just like sit it there. And on display, I just think they look so cute. It's just like a little like little home or a little shop. Okay, so that's the first one. So let's move on to this one. So like I said, we've got three of these, and this is from the second series, the party pop-ups. So this one is called, let me familiarise myself, Masquerade Theatre. Okay, so let's open it up. Okay, and same applies, you still get like the little pink like ball chain. Well, it's just sort of like a um, string pink chain and then you can just like attach the locket if you want. And this character comes with Holly Wood, which is a really clever name. So let's have a look at little Holly. So here she is, Holly Wood. <laughs> so sweet. So she's wearing like a little mask and stuff. And then here's her play set. So it's really cool, it's like February as well. So there's our blind bat, we'll look at that in a second. So this one's nice, so it is literally like a little theatre. So at the top here, these two open, like the curtains, and we've got like a stage. And there's a little place for our little mini shoppy to stand here. Another one of these little moving mechanism sort of style things. And then at the bottom, just some chairs where, you know, people can sit. So let's, like the audience could sit, I suppose. So she can just sit in there. The same thing again, she can move around. So that's so cute. Um, so let's see which one. So I only had one of these. So I have the little heel, star letter uh, heel. So I'm hoping that I have that little mask at the top or the bunch of roses. So fingers crossed we get a different one. Let's have a little look what we get. Oh, yay, different one. So I've got the little mask. So that's so cute. So what was this called again? Um, I can never remember the names for like more than a second. Marcy Mask. So that's really cool. So I've got a new one for the collection now. So I really like the little mini shoppies just to sort of add them to the scene. So our little mini shoppie now can just sit in the audience and watch her perform. There we go. So there's that one. So let's do this one next. I have two of these ones and this is also series two. And this one's called Butterfly Nail Boutique. So it's like a little nail salon. And it comes with Polly Polish, who is also a large size shoppy doll. And I absolutely love her shoppy doll. She's so pretty. So let's get this one open. Okay, so let's have a little look at Polly first. So she's really cute, amazing blue hair. Uh, she's got a slightly darker skin tone, which is nice to see a slight variation there. Nice little purple leggings and a grey skirt. And on the back, she's got lovely hot pink wings. Sorry about the terrible focus. I don't have a proper camera at the moment, so I have to deal with sort of crappy focus. But there she is, so cute. And then her little play set. So her little locket looks like this, so a nice big butterfly. And let's open it up. So in the back, you can see a really like nail salon style, so stacked with nail polishes. And then on the bottom, we have like a little chest here, which actually opens up. Um, and it just looks like there's more like nail utensils and stuff there. Um, and then once again, another one of these little move-in thingies that they like to include like with everyone. Um, and then it looks like a little checkout on this side. And just some more like beauty products and stuff. So let's see, so for these ones, I am looking for either Wingona Polish or Lovely Wings Lipstick. So I got the little uh, perfume before, so I'm hoping for either of those two. So fingers crossed and let's have a look and see which one we get. Oh yay, lucky, so I've got a second one now, so a different one. So this was Wingona Polish. So this is literally like a little um, butterfly shaped nail polish. That's seriously cute. So let's put these all in display. So let's stand her up there. And then we'll put the little nail polish down here. There we go, so cute. Okay, right, what should we do next? 
Let's do this one. So this is a different one, also the party pop-ups. Uh, and this one is called Fairy Cake uh, Birthday. So obviously this is a little birthday party scene and it comes with Michaela Wish. Or Mika Michaela Wish, maybe? The whole pun on like make a wish, so that's really cute. And there is also a full size doll of her, but I don't actually have the doll of her. Um, like of the shoppy doll. Okay, but here's the mini one. So she's really cute. Once again, has got little pink wings. So a lot of these party pop-ups are sort of almost like, like pixie themed or like got wings, which is really sweet. And her compact from the outside is so pretty. It looks like a little cupcake. Really love that. It's plain on the back. So open it up. So to be fair, this is one of my favourite ones, like the way it looks inside, it is really pretty. So at the top here, we've got like a little stand with like a cake and stuff, and then you can open up the bottom bit, and we see a couple of like little Shopkins underneath, like underneath the table, hiding, ready to steal the cake probably. And then we also have this little cake here that actually moves, and we've got presents under there, so that's so cool. I like this interaction actually, that it's just like hiding like some little cakes. That's not stickers, they are actually like 3D, which is nice. Uh, we've got a little seat over here, a stand for her there, and then on the far side it's like a little buffet. So we've got all our little food stuff, sandwiches. What is that white thing? It's like another cash register. Not sure why there's a cash register at like what, what looks like a birthday party, but we'll go with it. So let's give her a little seat. So she can just sit. Oh, wobbly, right, these are so fiddly. Ah, sit still. So you can just sit in there. And let's see what character we get. So I have Wishel Fairy Cake, and I'm hoping for either of those two, so Flutter Frosting or Pixie Cake. So they're all three different cakes. So where's our little blind bag? one do we have oh it looks like I have a new one as well flutter frosting really cute so a little pink cake with like a blue uh, pair of wings sort of on top that's good that we got another new one there um, and that can just sit in our little play set and there we go okay I do like that one that's so pretty okay let's go back to another one of these then so we had one of these before um, so we know what everything looks like inside and what the little doll looks like, so our little Hollywood. Uh, but we just want to see if we get a different one. So I have two out of three of them. So there's a small chance that we'll get a different one, but we can hope. So we are on the hunt for uh, Madame Rosa, so like the sort of bunch of roses. So it just looks the same inside. So come on, Madame Rosa, please be different. No, so we got the little shoe again, but still nice for you to see. So here's a different one, at least for this video. So it's like a tiny little shoe and it is called Starletta Hill. Now what I do find interesting is that on the picture here, if you look at the little heel, it's sort of purple and gold at the front, if you can see on it, it's very small. And then here, it's like the whole shoe is actually purple, but the heel is gold and just a little bow is gold. So it's almost like they changed the design from the illustration, which might be interesting. Right, okay, um, let's have a look at this one next. So this is from series one, and this is um, Petite Boutique. So it's a little bow star boutique, and it comes with Bella Bow. So she's a really cute shoppy doll as well in her large size. I say large, they're not really large, they're like smaller than Barbie dolls, but they just seem large like compared to these tiny ones. So, let's have a look at this one. So here's a Bella Bow, she's so cute. I love the detail. I think, to be fair, these little characters are the best miniature dolls I've seen. So I do really like the Polly Pocket play sets, but I think these um, dolls are just like better, like more fashionable and more detailed than the original vintage Polly Pocket dolls. So that's really cute. And then here's her little locket. So it's got a nice little bow, little blue handle, 
And by the way, if you're unsure about how these open, they, you just sort of squeeze them and then lift up. So it's really quite easy, just a little bit of pressure and it snaps. Okay, so this is really cool. So we've got like a sort of um, dress up area here. There's a little wardrobe that opens and then like a little stand so she can stand in front of the mirror. And then, <coughs> excuse me, on the bottom floor, um, we have like a little catwalk, I suppose. It's like got a little turn in circle so she can turn around. There's some shoes on either side and then like some bags and stuff here. So you could put her in the middle there and then sort of turn her around, which is really cute. Let's see who we want. So I have Cutie Clutch and Fluffy Buffy Sneaker already. I'm hoping for Runda Ruffle Shorts. So we're hoping for a little pair of shorts. So one in three chance, not a very high chance. Oh, so we have the little booty. So I think this is a really common one um, to get. I don't think they have like different rarities, but I swear I see a lot more of like some types of the little Shopkins than others. So here's the little boots, that's so cute. Okay, and that can just sit and watch her. Okay, so we're only down to a couple more. So let's have a look at another one of these. Um, so we looked at this one before with poly polish, this was sort of the nail salon one, but we just wanna see if we can get the third one we're missing. So we're missing the lipstick little mini Shopkin. So let's hope we can get that one. Here it is again. Let's open it up. It's nice, there's not, well, there's quite a lot of packaging with these, but there's not like loads of non-recyclable packaging. Like the mini blind bag is the only thing that, you know, can't really be recycled, but the rest of it is literally just like the plastic casing and the plastic like stand that holds them in. So it's not like too bad. And then the rest is like paper and cardboard. Okay, also we got, so it's new for this video, but I've already got this one. So this is Aroma Flutter. So this is a little perfume one. So that is a really cute one. Awesome, okay. So we're down to the last one now. So it was another one of these, so I had three of these. And we are still on the hunt for that, the Madame Rosa, so like the basket or the bunch of roses. So let's see if we can get that one. But yeah, it's quite cool. So I suppose even if you got like duplicates of these, it is nice to see if you can get the different characters. And then potentially you could maybe sell the play sets on or if you have friends that collect these you could swap like the different characters if you're looking for different ones so oh this one's trickier to open okay so that was just what it looked like once again and let's see if we get the one we're missing it feels kind of flat oh it's the mask again okay cool so we got the little mask again so that's really sweet Okay, so that'll finish that up. So I said there wasn't much waste, but my whole table is like really messy now. Um, but yeah, I really love these. I just think they're so cute, you know, just to hold up a few. Um, they are just like cute little designs and stuff. So I do love them. Um, and yeah, I just think it's really nice having that element of like getting the different shop uh, Shopkins, like the mini ones. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. Um, please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed and do subscribe if you want to see more toy videos. I'm going to be doing lots more Shopkins uh, videos, so if you like Shopkins in particular, do subscribe. And leave me a comment down below what, to, what you think of these. Do you collect Polly Pockets or do you collect like, the new style little secrets or anything like that? And I also find there's like so many different types of like Polly Pockets. Like There's new things that are coming out which are all like the compact themes. So if you know any other ones, let me know and I'd love to hear about them because I just love everything Polly Pocket. It's a fly, go away. <laughs> okay, thanks so much for watching. Bye.